of Donald Trump's children already addressed the convention. Ivanka Trump gets her turn tonight. She will introduce her father as he accepts the nomination. Juliana Goldman shows us the family's influence behind the scenes. Juliana, good morning. Good morning. Well, Donald Trump's children sit alongside their father in the boardroom. They help him negotiate deals. They decide on building projects. And now they're bringing that team into the political arena with Ivanka and her husband, Jared Kushner, playing the most prominent roles. In Donald Trump's inner circle, it's his children who are the brain trust. I love my family. They wield influence rarely seen in a presidential campaign. They urged Trump to fire campaign manager Corey Lewandowski in June, and they gave the final blessing for Mike Pence to be their father's running mate. Rick Davis was Senator John McCain's 2008 campaign manager. They've been a major factor in sort of creating stability around a candidate that didn't really have much of a campaign staff. But it's 34-year-old Ivanka who has stepped forward as chief surrogate for her father. She's got the toughest job potentially at this convention. Her job is to bridge the gap with women. Listen, I think people like the fact that somebody's willing to come out and speak, speak like a normal individual. You know, I mean, he relates to people. He's a very pragmatic guy. He's a no-nonsense, no BS type guy. And, I think that really resonates after a lot of lip service and a lot of political speak for many, many years. I think that really hits home. And, and quite frankly, it's not just on the Republican side of the aisle. It's on both sides. Oh, of no, the you're aisle. right about that. Now, did you go to Wharton like your dad? I went to Georgetown. You went to Georgetown. No slouch in your own right. Now, here. I'm incredibly honored to be part of this journey of which he's invited me, Don, Ivanka, Tiffany, Melania, my beautiful wife, Laura, our entire family to play such an integral part. New proof, Donald Trump's political rise is now a family affair. Just 10 days after giving birth to her third child, daughter Ivanka Trump was back out on the campaign trail, introducing her father this past week at a rally in New York. She spoke about leaving her baby for a short while to help her dad. It was not easy to leave him for so much as a minute to be here, but it was not easy to leave him for so much as a minute to be here. But it was incredibly important to me that I did. My father is battle tested. Now, in the moments when he is not great, <laughs> does he take counsel from anybody? Yeah, I think he very much does. You know, but he's also a guy who makes up his own decision, right? A lot of people will give his you know, opinions, and you know, sometimes he'll follow them, and sometimes he'll go off and do his own thing. And who do you think is his chief advisor? I think we are. Um, I think Don, Ivanka, and I are. I mean, we spend a, a lot of time with us, and you know, we have a very close relationship. Is there a hierarchy there? In my mind, yeah. Ivanka's at the top, but well, you Ivanka's, tell me. Ivanka's a princess, and she's the daughter, and she's amazing. <laughs> and you know, Don and I are a little bit of the maybe brutes, or you know, whatever you want to call it. But this November, I ask you to be true to yourself and vote for the candidate who you know is running for the right reasons. Vote for the candidate who has never been a politician. Vote for the candidate who has never received a paycheck from our government. Thank you. Vote for the candidate who can't be bought, sold, purchased, bribed, coerced, intimidated, or steered from the path that is right and just and true. Quite frankly, friends, vote for the one candidate who does not need this job. As a family, we are so proud of him. You know, he is going to win this. We are going to win this. He is going to make America great again. We are going to be crooked Hillary Clinton. There's no question about it. We're going to bring this country back. So thank you guys so much for all the support from our entire family. It's